In this lecture, I am going to discuss about how to connect MongoDB with data grip. So here I am using uh, a Studio 3D for MongoDB. Here you can see this is the server local host. 27017 is the port number and this is the list of database. And here this uh, database and there is the connection is there. So now I am going to open data grip. So here it's opening and uh, the first uh, thing is here you can see when you install the data grip then you can get here this uh, editor and this place uh, you need to go on this database explorer after that click on this plus then data source and there you can search here mongodb click there on the mongodb then automatically it's the taken host local host 27017 is the port and uh, here giving the meaningful connection name mongo db underscore com you can give any meaningful name then you can also give your comment to what the purpose of this and then after here authentication so this is not required and uh, here if I disconnect closing this one and uh, here going to okay wait to uh, one okay then after here let's click on this download so downloading two files uh, from the github side download mongodb jdbc stand along Okay, so file or oh, so uh, downloading, download completed, and this place you no need to give the user and the password. So here, database also not giving. And uh, when I click on OK, directly it's uh, going to connect there. Okay, so it's connecting, and then you can see this is here Studio 3. When I open this one, Studio 3D. So Studio 3D is uh, opening and there only need to give the user and the password directly you can connect but if uh, there is the user authentication is there then you can you should fill the authentication. Now the next is here you can see 0 of 4. So no item selected click on this triple dot here click on this all database. So all the database that's come there this place. There you can see Sony database. It has uh, seven collection. If I click on this employees, then you can see their employees table records. Okay, and after that you can create here. You can go on this query console, this place, or uh, then you can perform here SQL query. So using here select a start from and here you can get the list of options that's uh, select here CT and execute this one then you can see the record inside the CT table now if I go on this Sony database right click there then here you can or get here query option DDR option data driver and or this place you can do some import copy tables and you can use the diagram so diagrams you can find the dump model diagnostic this kind of things you can get inside data grip okay so one time going to repeat this one go to data source select the mongodb then or uh, this place you need to fill this all details and uh, here let's uh, giving go uh, this one at the local host and this time I know the database here Sony so let's give you Sony and if you give oh, here is the URL localhost and connecting with the Sony so test connection click on this test connection so it's doing the testing of oh, to connect 
here this is so uh, succeeded because i have given the correct database click on this ok then you can see here you connected with some special database or uh, this place on the mongodb here database is now sony sony database you are connected with only sony database there display so one of four or uh, click there or then uh, click there here all that's come there but here it's especially connected with the sony database and it has uh, seven collection now you can utilize that connection so this is the second way we can connect by giving go uh, database so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now this video is over so thanks for watching see you next to it thank you